Okay, hello everybody, what's going on? My name is Muhammad, welcome to another video. In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to solve for this definite integral. So the integral is from zero to pi, pi four of the natural logarithm of one plus tangent of x dx. Okay, now uh, there is a very good point, a very good idea to solve for this integral. And I'll mention the idea first and I'll prove it, and then I'll go ahead and uh, use it, okay? So the idea is, is that if we have a definite integral from a to b of a function like f of x dx, then this is equal to the same integration from a to b of the same function, but with of f of a plus b minus x dx. So uh, let's prove this. So proof of this property here, okay, sorry. So let uh, a plus b minus x equals u. So let's differentiate both sides. So that's gonna give us minus dx equals du. And then I will do the limits. Uh, so if x is equal to a, then u is going to be equal to um, a plus b minus a. That's going to give us b. And if x is going to be is equal to b, then that's going to give us u equals to um, a plus b minus b. So that's going to give us a. And so the integral i is going to become the integral from b to a of f of u minus du so minus is gonna we're gonna get the negative sign outside the integral du and that's gonna invert the limits of the integral uh, so that's gonna give us a to b f of u du which can be rewritten as the integral from a to b f of x dx of course so we're back to our first integral so we have proven the uh, this property Okay, so what we're going to do here, we're going to use this uh, property right away. So i is going to be equal to the integral from 0 to pi by 4, and then the natural logarithm of 1 plus tangent of, instead of x, now we need to replace uh, x by uh, 0 plus pi by 4 minus x. So that's going to give us pi by 4 minus x dx. And then we can go ahead and use the tangent of the difference of two angles. So that's going to give us the integral from 0 to pi by 4 of the natural logarithm of 1 plus. That's going to give us the tangent of pi by 4, which is basically 1 minus tan of x divided by 1 plus tangent of pi by 4, which is 1 multiplied by tangent of x, which is tan x, okay, dx. And then, of course, we can uh, simplify the expression, uh, the natural logarithm of 1. Uh, we can basically uh, uh, simplify the expression as 1 plus tangent of x. And that's going to give us 1 plus tangent of x plus 1 minus tangent of x. So tangent of x is going to get canceled with tangent of x. And we're going to be left out with 2 in the numerator, dx. And then we can rewrite the natural logarithm as the difference of two uh, natural logarithms. So that's going to give us the integral from 0 to pi by 4 of, between two brackets, the len of 2 minus the natural logarithm of uh, 1 plus tangent of x, of course. And then we close the brackets, dx. So the first integral is going to give us len 2 multiplied by pi by 4. So pi by 4 uh, multiplied by len 2 minus. Now, if we can notice, the second term okay, is going to give us the original integral itself. So that's going to give us basically i itself. And then we can move i to the other side. So that's going to give us twice i equals pi by 4 len 2 and from that we can go ahead and solve for i which is basically pi by 8 len 2 and that's the answer to this question okay if you like this video guys hit like 
and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click the bell so you don't miss anything in the future. Thank you for watching and see you in another video.